I promised myself I would never see him again. Ten years is far too soon, after what he did. Yet here I am, reporting on the least important story for tomorrow's paper. The grand reopening of his Circus Electric. He hasn't lost his charisma. I'll give him that. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, always hold on, members of them. Always giving them something new, something bigger. We'll give you the fear of horror. Something more dangerous. We like her at the end. I've seen these two before. That's their happy face. Huh, <laughs> maybe they'll arrest Uncle. That'd be a story I could get behind. Let's go! they doing? Die! What? Die! Die! Then I hear him. Grok! Balthy! Save my niece! What this? Bring these bothersome bobbies to their knees. <laughs> I do believe your rubber ball cracked his rib. Jolly good show, Grok. Places, people. Positioning matters. Are. Don't attack, just move forward. Trust me. <laughs> A 
rather eventful reunion after ten years, was it not, dear niece? Saving lives isn't really your style, Uncle. But thank you. <laughs> I see your mother's lion remains as spirited as ever. Yes, and just as blind, no thanks to you. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some facts to gather. Ah, for your circus story. Of course. Dear God, no! I need to understand what the hell just happened here. That's the new story. Come, let's find Dr. Mabry. He hid once this maddening took hold, but... But he's a brilliant man. With brilliant... Unlike certain present company. Hmm. I'll not have you speak of Grok in that way. Or growl, as it were. Where is Dr. Mabry? We've looked everywhere. Not quite everywhere. No Dr. Mabry in here, but I do believe I spot some new talent. Bertha the Fireblower, you any good in a fight? A fight, sir? Oh, he brought a mime! Yes, yes, Burn. Mm. Her very name puts the breath in fire breathing. Trumpeting Brock. Everyone's increased devotion inspires us all. Worth all ten shillings for sure. Maybe even eleven. No, just ten. Thank <laughs> you. 
normal for you, Ringmaster? Only very recently. You just endangered this poor girl's life. Bertha, are you hurt? A scratch or two. Nothing a night in the sleeping cart won't heal. So lovely to see you, banged up as you may be from surviving out there. Uh, perhaps the sleeping car should be yours for the evening. Oh, and here comes Dr. Mabry. Help! 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 Save me from these relentless brigands! More of these fop doodles? Oh, bugger. want my opinion on this, don't you, Amelia? The pillar of power you designed was lit. Exactly then, everything around us went to hell. You, uh, you should see what happened to the London Bridge. The London Bridge? Has it fallen down, my fair Maybury? Or worse, it, it disappeared. My drones confirm it. Vanished. Vanished? How? I, I can get you there, uh, to see for yourself, uh, with a map. I just need, just need time. Uh, may I bring it to you shortly? All things come shortly from you, Ollie. Join us at the circus tent when you can. That's where she'll be, with me, 
watching how I plan my shows. What? You don't want to recruit more talent at the train first? A marvelous suggestion, Amy. First the train, then the circus tent. And this is how it's done. 